The Assistant Secretary of Defense for Nuclear, Chemical and Biological Defense Programs, or ASD NCB, is the Principal Advisor to the Secretary of Defense, Deputy Secretary of Defense and the Under Secretary of Defense for Acquisition, Technology and Logistics on Policy and Plans for Nuclear, Chemical, and Biological Defense Programs. The Assistant Secretary of Defense for Nuclear, Chemical and Biological Defense Programs develops policies, advice, and recommendations on, nuclear weapons, chemical, biological, radiological, and nuclear CBRN, medical and non-medical defense, safety, surety, security, and safe destruction of the chemical weapon stockpile, nuclear, chemical and biological arms control activities and related plans and programs. The Assistant Secretary of Defense for Nuclear, Chemical and Biological Defense Programs also oversees the Defense Threat Reduction Agency S Cooperative Threat Reduction Program. Center. The Director of DTRA reports directly to the Assistant Secretary of Defense for Nuclear, Chemical and Biological Defense Programs, before the National Defense Authorization Act for fiscal year 2011 on January 7, 2011, the Assistant Secretary of Defense for Nuclear, Chemical and Biological Defense Programs was known as the Assistant to the Secretary of Defense for Nuclear and Chemical and Biological Defense programs. Three Deputy Assistant Secretaries of Defense report to the Assistant Secretary of Defense for Nuclear Chemical and Biological Defense programs. The Deputy Assistant Secretary of Defense for Chemical and Biological Defense (DASD) CBD. The Deputy Assistant Secretary for Nuclear Matters (DASD) NM. The Deputy Assistant Secretary of Defense for Threat Reduction and Arms. Control DASD track. In addition, the Director of the Defense Threat Reduction Agency reports directly to the Assistant Secretary of Defense for Nuclear, Chemical and Biological Defense Programs. The Deputy Assistant Secretary of Defense for Chemical and Biological Defense oversees development of chemical, biological, radiological and nuclear CBRN defenses to protect national interests at home and abroad, handling Department of Defense efforts related to, science and technology, advanced development and test and evaluation of chemical, biological, radiological and nuclear defenses and the Chemical and Biological Defense Program Objective Memorandum POM. The Deputy Assistant Secretary for Nuclear Matters is primarily the focal point for activities and initiatives related to sustaining a safe, secure, and effective nuclear deterrent and countering threats from nuclear terrorism and nuclear proliferation. This office serves as a primary point of contact for Congress, other agencies, and the public for those programs. The Deputy Assistant Secretary for Nuclear Matters's office is staffed by representatives from all areas of the nuclear community, including the U.S. Navy, the U.S. Air Force, the National Guard Bureau, the United States Nuclear Command and Control Systems Support Staff, the Defense Threat Reduction Agency, the Department of Energy, the National Nuclear Security Agency, Los Alamos National Laboratory, Lawrence Livermore National Laboratory, Sandia National Laboratories, the Kansas City Plant, and the National Security Agency. The Deputy Assistant Secretary of Defense for Threat Reduction and Arms Control is the Principal Advisor to the Assistant Secretary for Defense for Nuclear, Chemical and Biological Defense Programs for Acquisition Oversight, Implementation, and Compliance with Nuclear, Biological, and Chemical Treaties, Cooperative threat reduction, chemical demilitarization programs, and building global partner capacity to counter weapons of mass destruction. The Deputy Assistant Secretary for Defense for Threat Reduction and Arms Control oversees the Defense Threat Reduction Agency's Cooperative Threat Reduction Program and the Chemical Demilitarization Program. 
This office also, oversees implementation of and compliance with existing and prospective nuclear, biological, and chemical arms control agreements, integrates programs to combat proliferation weapons of mass destruction, and assists the Deputy Assistant Secretary for Defense for Nuclear, Chemical and Biological Defense Programs as Executive Secretary of the Counterproliferation Program Review Committee CPRC and Chair of the Standing Committee of the CPRC. Topic History The Office of the Assistant Secretary of Defense for Nuclear, Chemical and Biological Defense Programs functions can be traced back to the U.S. Department of Defense's Military Liaison Committee MLC, formed in the early Cold War to coordinate military requirements with the United States Atomic Energy Commission. The MLC was the channel of communication between the DoD and AEC and later, the U.S. Energy Research and Development Administration and the U.S. Department of Energy on all matters relating to military applications of atomic weapons or atomic energy. It addressed matters of policy, programming, and funding of the military application of atomic energy. In 1951, the Secretary of Defense moved the Military Liaison Committee to the Pentagon. Its chairman became the deputy to the Secretary of Defense for Atomic Energy Matters. In 1953, this position was renamed the Assistant to the Secretary of Defense for Atomic Energy. The National Defense Authorization Act for fiscal year 1987, PL 99 to 661, passed in November 1986, abolished the Military Liaison Committee, replacing it with the Nuclear Weapons Council. Just over a year later, the National Defense Authorization Act for fiscal years 1988–1989 PL 100–180 created the position of Assistant to the Secretary of Defense Atomic Energy. In 1994, the Assistant to the Secretary of Defense Atomic Energy was given control over the Defense Nuclear Agency DNA, which became the Defense Threat Reduction Agency. In February 1996, the National Defense Authorization Act for fiscal year 1996 PL 104 to 106 officially created the Office of the Assistant to the Secretary of Defense for Nuclear and Chemical and Biological Defense Programs or ASTD NCB to replace that of the Assistant to the Secretary of Defense Atomic Energy. The Clinton administration declined to nominate an assistant to the Secretary of Defense for Nuclear and Chemical and Biological Defense programs between 1997 and 2001, having determined as part of its defense reform initiative that the position should be eliminated. Congress insisted that the Pentagon maintain the office, arguing it was necessary to ensure appropriate senior-level policy oversight and implementation guidance within the Department of Defense. In January 2011, President Obama signed the National Defense Authorization Act for FY 2011, renaming the Assistant to the Secretary of Defense for Nuclear and Chemical and Biological Defense Programs the Assistant Secretary Secretary of Defense for Nuclear, Chemical and Biological Defense Programs. Topic: Office Holders. The table below includes both the various titles of this post over time, as well as all the holders of those offices. <laughs>